Elizabeth Gigu, welcome to WPC TV. You are a prominent member of the Parti Socialiste in France, a former minister, and now very important in the Assemblée Nationale on foreign policy in particular. French foreign policy has been quite active at the moment. What is the biggest challenge? I think that the, uh, the biggest challenge is, uh, well, there are two big challenges. One is on our east side, uh, the question, of course, of Ukraine. Yes. And, uh, and the second is, uh, is security in Africa and the Sahel uh, region, which, of course, is a question for the whole of Europe, uh, which is something that is beginning to be understood, but not, uh, not well enough, I think. But you've established a permanent, well, quasi-permanent force in the Sahel region with allies at the moment. So in a sense that, you know, you can see the way yes, forward. Yes, but it's, uh, we should be, uh, we should be more, more present. Not only, uh, of course, because military intervention is, is never uh, the solution. It is sometimes absolutely necessary uh, in Mali to avoid yeah. an Islamic state right in the middle of Africa. Uh, but uh, but uh, uh, the, the real solution is both political and, uh, and on development, of course. And this requires a change in governance, uh, more efficient uh, uh, help from uh, European uh, countries, and of course a new strategy of uh, um, um, partenariat, partnership. Yes. Uh, between uh, between uh, develop, developed countries and Africa, because of course there is a lot of potential uh, in Africa, which is you know which should should be which the difference be between Absolutely. potential development and real development is <laughs> the gap is very wide. What about Ukraine? What is the solution there? Well, uh, um, I I think that uh, uh, there is no other solution than to have uh, to to implement the Minsk. Uh, Process, process, and to have both parties uh, around the table. So, uh, obviously, both uh, uh, Mr. Poroshenko and Mr. Putin should, uh, you know, uh, uh, compromise. And uh, uh, I think we should uh, continue to be very firm towards uh, Mr. Mr. Putin as far as Crimea and the east of uh, and the integrity and the territorial integrity of Ukraine is concerned. But. Uh, we cannot. Uh, we, we have to uh, to have a strategy uh, to end this crisis someday on strong basis. Because I cannot imagine that Europe remain in a, a long-standing uh, confrontation with Russia. We, we have to find ways to get out of that. And of course, uh, uh, it's mainly for the Ukrainian government, president, government, and of the Russian to uh, uh, be together, but with the help of the uh, European uh, community, of course. And I think that uh, it's good that François Hollande went to meet uh, Monsieur Putin just now. I think it, it's a good uh, moment to do, to do it. We'll keep our fingers crossed. Elizabeth Gigou, thank you so much. Thank you.